Hello and welcome to our final episode of Fallout 4's main storyline. We're going to be activating Liberty Prime today and taking on the Institute. No way anyone survived that. Yes, we ought to make sure. Look, I was I'm able to keep the Institute from getting their hands talk. on the beryllium agitator. I'm glad to see you're still in one piece. I wouldn't have made it without your help. That's funny. I seem to remember having to talk you into letting me come along. Anyway, we shouldn't stand around here talking. We've got a lot of work to do. Well, this is it. Moment of truth. We've pre-programmed Liberty Prime's battle coordinates into his navigational processor. As soon as he's under his own power, he'll head straight for the Institute. Elder Maxon wants you to follow, and make sure he arrives at the CIT in one piece. I've checked every wire and every bolt on the big guy. All we need to do is plug in the agitator, start Prime's reactor, and cross our fingers. We don't need luck, Ingram. We've got you. I didn't do it alone. Look, I discussed it with Elder Maxon, and we think you should be the one who has the honor of starting Liberty Prime. Just plug the beryllium agitator into his reactor port, then head back down here and press the transfer button. Good luck, Paladin. Ad Victorium. All right, here we go. It's basically a giant fusion core. We just gotta go down and throw the switch now. Liberty Prime will be throwing nukes like footballs in no time. Liberty Prime. Full system analysis. All systems nominal. Weapons hot. Mission. The destruction of any and all Chinese communists. Probability of Chinese victory. Impossible. Ad Victorium. Proceeding to target's coordinates. Freedom is the sovereign right of every American. Democracy is non-negotiable. It's very Iron Giant. Communism is the very definition of failure. All right, well, we're entering this war with a giant war machine in front of us. Gonna need all the ammo I can get. Oh, 
Holy crap. I guess we're going in. The mission is proceeding as planned, Paladin. Well done. Our next target is the reactor. If anything tries to slow us down, I'm ordering you to destroy it. Man, more machine. Once we reach our target, you'll need this. It's a fusion pulse charge. Attach it to the reactor, and it can be detonated remotely from a safe distance. It will be more than enough to annihilate the Institute in its entirety. Ingram, you're to remain here and teleport us out when the job is done. Get that thing wor working. All right, this is where we entered when we came here the first time. I've got this covered, Paladin. Get to that reactor. Ah, oh, the door we could never open before is now open. Was wondering why we couldn't get through here before. This is the Institute disappointed. You must die now, Hugh. Well, I guess we're going to shoot our way through all this. It'd be kind of nice if it would stop targeting our allies. Well, traveling through here is not too bad so far. We have a whole army with us. Is someone present? Huh? You can't hide from us. What's that? kind of cool to see they were building like protectrons and then they advanced all the way up to synths. That thing gonna turn on and attack us?
It's weird to see the broken half of the Institute. Okay, now we're out in the main area of the Institute, the part we're more used to seeing. we're supposed to kill them but they're alerting everyone to our presence Oh no, the gorillas are out. Synthetic gorilla meat. Gross. Not much I can do there, it just gives me intel. Alright, seems like we're headed to the reactor. Busy looting here. I'm definitely not going to run out of ammo for this gun for a while. 
Unless we fire like 300 bullets in this next room. Been waiting for some sort of massive boss, but it doesn't seem like it's gonna happen. Casually decontaminating in the middle of a war. Oh, that was a nasty grenade. I think we're in the reactor room now. We're definitely taking rads, which means we're near some sort of reactor. In and out, now. We make this fast and precise. Good work, now. I think it's time to leave. Sir. Dr. Ingram, do you copy? Our mission is complete. I need you to transport us out of here immediately. Time to go, Palace. Our work here is done. Proctor Ingram, it's time to teleport us out. Sorry, Elder, I would, but... Well, this child showed up. He claims to be the Paladin's son, sir. That's clearly a sin. I promise I won't be too much trouble. I'll stay out of your way, and you won't even have to take care of me. So can I go with you? Please! Attention all personnel. Evacuation order. You're not going anywhere with me. You're not my son. But you can't just leave me here. I don't want to die. Please, just think about it for a second. You're not Sean! You're not Sean! You're a robot. Made to think you're just going to leave me here? I can't believe it. I hate you! Attention all personnel. Evacuation order issued. Authorization. One. Three. One. Please. All right, Ingram. Your assigned evacuation point. Fire it up. Hang on. Thank you for your cooperation. You still not going to let us leave? Come on. Please, Dad. All right, Ingram. I want to go with you. Fire it up. Hang on. You're telling me you leave that kid here to die? He's your son. He's a synth, Ingram. He's not really my son. Are you kidding me? The Institute made synths that look like children? I don't even know what to say. Except that they deserve what's coming to them. You're clear to go, then. Ready? Absolutely. Let's get out of here. You got it, Paladin. I'm sending you to the detonation site. I'll set the relay to send the last of us to the Pridwin and make sure everyone is out. When that reactor goes up, this place will be nothing but a smoking crater full of rubble. Should be quite a sight. Looks like your work here is done, Paladin. Authorization 1YR3. Please proceed to your assigned evacuation point. Thank you for your cooperation. There we go, out of the Institute. Dr. Ingram is asleep, but will be outside the blast radius. Press that button, and you not only defeat our enemy, you restore order and decency to the Commonwealth. It's time, Paladin. The Institute and their synth abominations must be eradicated. I 
think we eradicated everything. It's one hell of a blast. over me. The heat, the force, the radiation, the fear. It's the end of the world all over again. I close my eyes. I see my life before all of this, before the bombs. Everything can change in an instant, and the future you plan for yourself shifts whether or not you're ready. At some point, it happens to all of us. This wasn't the world I wanted, but it was the one I found myself in. The Commonwealth. My home. Ripped apart and put back together. I thought, I hoped, I could find my family, cheat time, make us whole again. The way we were. But now I know. I know I can't go back. I know the world has changed. That the road ahead will be hard. This time, I'm ready. Because I know war. War never changes. Well, we've decimated this part of the wasteland. Elder Maxon, you've done an exemplary job here, Paladin. Without your unwavering loyalty to our cause, this victory would never have been possible. I did it for the people of the Commonwealth. You truly have become one of us, brother. The Institute has been wiped clean from the face of our world. It's time we close this chapter on the Commonwealth and begin one anew. Then let's get to it. I'm pleased that you're anxious to continue your service for the Brotherhood, but this is neither the time nor the place to discuss it. Return to the Pridwin, and we'll decide what needs to be done. All right, well, that's going to do it for the main storyline. I hope you'll come see what we're playing next on the channel. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye for now.